Nice to meet Hi, you. Nice to meet you. Thanks for being here tonight. Sure. Um, so season two, congratulations on Thank the season you. two pickup. You Thank guys are you. in. You guys are already in production, correct? Yeah, we're shooting the third episode already. Wow. So you guys just had this Hollywood Forever Cemetery yes. viewing with the fans. How important is to you to be able to interact with the fans with your show? It's huge for our show, and I think I have to be honest. I didn't have a Twitter account before <laughs> our show started. I noticed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I bear. I don't really do anything on it as it is, but. It became, you know, our fans were such a part of it, and I think we were so lucky with those reruns on Fridays that we could have all of the writers and the actors live tweeting, and Orlando's such the king of that, and I think really kicked everyone into gear with doing it, and our fans have been unbelievable. That's great. Um, so what was it initially that drew you to Sleepy Hollow? Um... Wow. Well, Phil Iscove came in with like this, just this great idea of sort of combining Rip Van Winkle and Sleepy Hollow and Alex and Bob Kurtzman and Orsi were looking for something to write that year. And I think felt like it was since Phil had never written before and he was so open, it was the perfect opportunity. And we had all done Hawaii Five O with Len Wiseman. So we were like, Hey, we're going to do this show about a headless guy in modern day. And he loved it. And so we all sold it together, and we really all concocted it, every beat of it, together. It was great. Great, and we're here at Fox's Girls' Night Out, so we have a couple Girls' Night Out questions for you. Sure. Who is your pa favorite pop star? My favorite pop star. It's so funny. A couple years ago, I would have said Justin Bieber because <laughs> my kids love him and probably know every song of his. Oh my God, I don't even know. I don't know if I have one. Is okay. that terrible? No, it's not. I mean, there's so many to choose from. So we'll just say, we won't say Justin Bieber just because of Justin all the, that that's happening. But Early Justin Bieber. Early Justin Bieber. <laughs> we can go with early YouTube Justin Bieber. <laughs> right, exactly. exactly. Um, okay, who is your favorite leading lady? Oh my God, this is so much pressure to think on my feet. I mean, I guess I guess Meryl Streep is everyone's favorite lady because you just never know what she's going to do or how she's going to transform herself. Mm -hmm. I guess I'd have to go with her. I agree with you. Meryl is my favorite yeah. too. Yeah. Um, and last one, what is your favorite romantic comedy? Movie? Movie. Oh, God. It's so funny because I'm sure I'll walk away and I'll think, oh my God, how could you forget? I mean, as I always loved Notting Hill. I always loved that movie. I guess, I don't know if that's my favorite, but that's the one. Is you can, Reese a romantic comedy? Yeah, we'll yeah. take that romantic comedy slash musical. Yeah, that's yeah. probably my favorite. It's, it's a little bit of everything. Yeah, that's my yeah. favorite. <laughs> All right, we'll have a great time inside. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you.